What's up everyone, it's Magazine Fjord and today I will show you how to update your Samsung Galaxy S6 Edge for the latest Android uh, update. So uh, this uh, Samsung Galaxy S6 Edge has Android 6.0 Android version and we gonna update it to 7.0. So for that you will have to have a PC, USB cable and some software. So uh, let's begin with the software. First of all, the most important thing to have, this is Odin 3. Points, just Odin version number 3. But uh, there will be many possibilities. So for example, if you just type in into your web browser, or you can as well log in to my website where you can download this Odin version. So um, that will be okay. There is no. So for example, if we get into Odin official downloads, so you have the choice here. I recommend to download the latest one. So just click on that. And you see, get the direct download link for latest Samsung Odin 3.12.3. And as well, you will be able to download from my website, which you will, which I will put into description. So here we are, and this is already downloaded. So we have to get this and put anywhere we want on your PC. So for that, for example, I put it on my desktop, but. I think I already have that. So once you will put this into a desktop, you will see it here, for example. So we have to open that and make sure to open it with an administrator. So just click on run as administrator. And for that, I will just close my application, which is now, which was running. Let's do it. Run as administrator. So we have here, and another thing, what you have to do is to download latest Android version, which I suggest to download from official Samsung mobiles firmwares. So that will be downloaded for, from some mobiles or some mobile that's here and on find firmware you just type your model so in our case it's six edge and i know which model i have so this is exact model then click here and make sure guys that you log in to your website so you must log in if you don't have the account just make join click for join and also, um, this software will be available for many regions. You can see it here. So today it appeared on free countries and careers. And so far in, in some parts we don't have it yet. So for example, you can download United Kingdom, Ireland, which is not locked to any career. You can see it just without anything or you can if you have your own country here's also it's for no locked and we can find that for some uh, countries it's still locked so we just check this one also make sure that uh, you can also download the, this from SiteSense but we are doing it from Odin, Odin way. So just click on regular download and simply here just go for download sample. Okay, join. So you will have to click on this one, but since, since I'm not uh, logged in, so I will not have I will have first to log in to this website but once you log in you will be able to download the file and usually it takes if 
if you have a good uh, internet access and connection so usually it takes 2.5 an hour so 2.5 hour and once you download that so it will be in rar file and once you open this file you will have to extract the only file here which is the file extension md5 just put it anywhere on your pc so i already put that onto the desktop you can see it here so this is it so we are almost done another thing what you have to do you have to put your device into download mode so you have to put at the same time volume down home and power button so i will do that and just i hold a little bit so here we have a warning so we have to click continue and here we are in the download mode so the next thing what we have to do we have to have original usb cable that's a must because otherwise the device will not be recognized on your pc and also make sure that you download the latest samsung uh, usb drives so that you will be able to find on my website which i will put into my description so make sure to download usb drivers from my website also you can find that anywhere on the internet so once you're in download mode so make sure to put usb cable well this is nokia cable but it's still um, working but some third-party cables are not you will not be able to uh, the device will not be found so you can see here that the device was found on com.3 uh, com8 number 8 and it shows that it's added with also number 8 so a ne next thing you do you click here and search for the, this file which we downloaded usually uh, you can see that the size is other over 3 gigabytes just double click on that and wait a little bit because this file takes a little bit even it will show that Odin is not responding you can clearly see here just take your time wait a little bit And um, for this video, in fact, I will not update my device because I'm waiting for the official one. And once I get it, so I will be... Because there, there is some things that you need to know once you are doing this. Because if you are updating through Odin, so make sure that the Samsung... Um, can find it here that current binary here is Samsung official and once I update through Odin it will not be any more official it will mean that my device lost a warranty and also this process can also soft break your device which uh, but uh, there are many solutions for that so and but another thing is that once i update it he here sometimes your device will not be able to get uh, updates through ota which is over over uh, the air and that means that i will from th this time i will also that i will 
only need will be able to update only through Odin. So, and um, so the final stage, what you have to do, you have to click start. And from that time, you will be, uh, there will be a process and which will say um, like it succeeded or fail. Succeed will uh, write, will be a green color here. And if fail will be a red color, but do not panic. Never panic because there are many solutions and I even one year ago I put a video how to solve this and uh, I hope that this uh, method will still work but if not please uh, write me and I'll be able to search for your solution. So uh, also make sure that once updating do not really do not put your cable off because otherwise you will have to do the same click on the volume down power button and hope button and it will be uh, again uh, getting into download mode so that's it and so that's it mainly what i wanted to say and here you will be able to so to update your device to android 7.0 nougat latest version and thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. And so please like, subscribe, and if possible, you can donate by PayPal. So thank you for watching and peace out.